Hello everybody and welcome to Cleo Fails the Cat Lady. Now I saw this game on Steam uh, for uh, pounds and and yes it's it it's it looks as like you would expect. It's it's a bit creepy and um, <clears throat> yeah the name it, the name sort of fits. Um, as far as I know there is no mouse controls. There is no mouse controls. There are no mouse controls. Um, so we're just going to. Um, we're going to see what happens because this actually looks like it could be very, very creepy. So, 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 so let's play. Clicking. My name is Susan Ashworth. Hi, Susan. My name is Cleo. I live alone in this old two bedroom flat. I rarely go outside. Mm, social anxiety is a pisser. Kitty tail. So that's a photograph of a cat on a generic black body because they couldn't be bothered to texture Some the body. It's a lonely life and I guess that's true, but I don't like people's company. No, me neither. Not lately anyway. Not ever, to be honest. People suck. We all we all are, are, are okay with that. People suck. We know people suck. Okay. I only trust my cats these days and I will miss them dearly, but they will understand. Like they always have. Is this before or after they die of starvation? Stays with me till the end. And hunger. He because they can't me get out. As if he knew. Oh, he did. Because because anything with eyes that glow that brightly, they know. Not surprised that she's committing suicide. Anyone? This is coming because as a surprise to no earlier one. Earlier tonight, I swallowed a whole bunch of pills. That is the creepiest blink They're in the legal, fucking world. Of course. Prescribed by my doctor for my sleeping problems. Yeah, possibly not going to kill you. I've with taken that. 34. Oh, that might. Over, over a long period of time. Covered. And now the room around me spins in a blurry tango as my heart slows down. Fucking hearts. What are they good for? Absolutely nothing. Creepy blinking cat. Stop being creepy and blinking. I wouldn't mind if the if any it was... second now. I will be dead. If the light didn't go through the eyelids. Oh, look, there's a moth. Calm. I'm ready for it. Mm-hmm. How high are up you that the cloud's doing that across your window? I've only got one thing to say now. Bye? Laters, dude? Thanks for nothing. Uh-huh. Goodbye. Yeah, fuck you. Thanks for nothing, my ass. God, people, people, oh. Come on, then. Bitchy moody woman is bitchy and moody. There's a surprise. Oh, hello. Chapter one. I get it, I get it. Chapter one. Let's go, let's go. Let me play the game that I want to be playing. House in the woods. Right. Okay. Harvester Games presents dun 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 by the same people who made Harvest Moon. Dun dun dun. No. Okay, okay, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. I don't really care who made the game at this point. I would just want to play the game. Please let me play the game. Oh look, it's like corn. Oh is that is that is that me? Wow, I'm old. Press. Oh, okay. So it's a, a keyboard thing. I'm walking. I'm walking in the air. Oh, I like the wind change. That's that's a good thing. I'm walking in the moonlit sky. Wow, that that corn got short really quickly. I'm walking into the sunset. Bam bam bam. Ba -da -da. Na -na 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 -na. Oh, what flag is that? That is... My gut wants to say Russian. I don't know. Maybe. We'll see. Oh. It's a house. Up to open the door. Oh, okay. okay. Cycle through. Oh, press. Up to open interaction menu. Cycle through. Available options with up and down. And press enter. Uh, ex examine eminent. I feel strangely drawn to this place. I must find a way to unlock this padlock and get inside. It's locked. Okay. 
we're fucking off then. Boo -boo -doo -boo 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 -boo. Apparently I'm in a car crash area. What the fuck? Am I, am, is this just a game about walking? Poorly rendered character walking through backgrounds. Dun 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 Boo! FT37, that's probably gonna come in. No pedestrian access. Fuck you, I'm a ghost. Okay. Can I? Ew! Ectoplasmy! Can I run at all? Thanks, game! That, that didn't scare me at all, you cock. <sighs> What's her face? Walks through backgrounds. Da -da 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 -da. Boo! Da -da 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 -da. Oh, hello. Ambulance. Open the door. Let's see what's inside. Well, there's lots of blood on it. It's locked. Examine it. Can't go any further. No shit. Lock in the tunnel exit. Right. Right, so I can't get through. And there's been no... Can I not jump? Can I... Yeah. Well, I don't understand what's going on. Okay, so so I've got to go back somehow. What? Huh? What's making that noise? You don't want to know. No! Why are you going? Hello? Who's there? Your worst name. Answer me. Yeah, let's walk towards the creepy noise. Okay, this game got a lot creepier. <laughs> That's me. It's me, my cold dead body right in front of my eyes. What's it doing here? Susan up. Examine. I look so calm. Turn head. Ew. Bleh. Open eyes. I got green. Oh, hang on. What was that? Hey, apparently my eyes shine a little. Open her mouth. There's the key. Is that key in my mouth? Let's take it with me. Yay! Let's fuck off back to where we were. Open inventory. Press down to open inventory. Ah. Not long ago, a key, even a key wouldn't open my mouth. Okay. Um... Okay, let's keep going. Let's, let's, let's. She's so calm. Let's chill out whilst I'm walking. Not even a little bit freaked out. Fuck! Did I get through that okay? I did! Yay! Well, can't go back. That, that's probably a good thing. Can't go back to the black and white area. So there was a massive pile up with my body and I caused all this. It's my fault. I now have to do something. Oh, we're back in... There's a deer. Hello! Hello! And now there's a tree. Okay. Uh, inventory. Use. Yeah, I thought that's what might happen. Weird that, isn't it? Oh, look. And now there's a heartbeat. Planks. Examine. Hole has been boarded up with this plant. It says emergency power switch danger. Look through. There's definitely something there. Can't tell for sure, but it looks like a switch. Well, not strong enough. Okay. Machine. Examine. Too long a sacrifice can make a stone of the heart. Would it take another sacrifice to turn it back? Maybe I'm being silly, but this is just some more machinery after all. Switch it on. Doesn't seem to be a single switch or button on this machine. How do you turn it on? Well, I can't go any further. Can't do the planks. So I'm assuming I've got to follow the deer. Follow the deer, follow the deer. Tra la la la, follow the deer. 
in the calm, open oasis of the grasslands. There were fields a minute ago. I'm not freaked out at all. Tra la la la, follow the deer, follow the tree, examine the deer. No. Can I not run? I should be able to run. I feel like I should be running. Because I could run a second ago. Well, what the fuck's gonna happen now? Hello, 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 dear. Hello, dear. Hello! Well, there's a fire. Terrific. And once again, that's me, I think. Okay. Hanging body. Examine. My dead body, hanging from a tree. Should be scared, but I just feel empty. Well, that's one of us, at least. Wait, what's that shiny thing on net? Is that a key? Search the body. Body is too high. Can't reach. Okay. Get the rope. Untie the rope. Take me hours to undo this knot. Are you shitting me? Okay, we're going into the door. Door seems bolted from the other side. Okay, so can't undo the knot because I'm an idiot. Can't un can't get the body because I can't climb trees. So I can't remember this place. Am I lost? Yes, you are. Also crazy and dead. <laughs> okay. Okay. Follow the crow. Huh. Thank you, Captain Crowface. Right, it's a deer. Pull out the knife. And, and... Seriously, what's going on with this? Who's done this? Is anyone else here? No, just you and your crazy. Door. Unbolt. Okay. <coughs> Very confused now. <coughs> Body, look closer. Susan, examine. Looks like I'm just sleeping. Search pockets. Empty. Take key. Right. Leave. Where did I need a key for? I didn't need a key, did I? I'm obviously going to need a key in the future. Let's go back through the door. Am I supposed to go through the door? I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm not going through the door. That, that's just creepy. I mean... Uh, dear game. What the fuck? What the fuck is wrong with you? <coughs> Was there something else that was locked? Hmm. Hello. We're in this place again, where we walk slightly far. Yes, the gate! Use the key on the gate. And then open the fucking gate. Thank you. Oh, of course, the creepy music starts now. Oh, hello. Welcome to my house, Susan Ashworth. It is death. I destroy have been waiting worlds. for you, my dear. You creepy fuckface. I knew you would turn up one fine day, Lexus. Who, who are you? Bad voice acting is bad. I have so many names. It's hard to pick one. Death. But I'm curious. Who do you think I am? Death. An old lady who lives in the walls. Are you God? Are you the devil? I don't really know. Uh, death? death? Interesting. Yes, perhaps that's what I am. I come when there's something to take, but I never give anything back. Yeah, that sounds like death to me. I am doom, but I'm salvation too. Right. Not feared by most, but adored by some also. Okay. Some like yourself, Susan. 
a dude? Don't flatter yourself, old lady. I don't even know you. You just said no, she's dead. that's not quite right. I've been around for a while. Oh, your misery. You company. Always there, you know? Always there. So I was wrong. You're not death? No, I am not. Depression. Perhaps I am life. Uh -huh. Then again, does it really matter? Uh... Where am Where I? Is this place? This, my dear, is my <clears throat> humble kingdom. And this house is my castle. Looks like a shitty house to me. I rarely invite people in, just like you. I like my solitude. Uh-huh. But I get you the feeling that she doesn't like anything, to be honest. Guest, and I'm going to make an exception. Me? Lucky you. Special. I can tell you now that there's nothing special about me, lady. Don't bring yourself yeah, down, right. Susan Sure, Ashworth. nothing special at all, except my ability to walk Today, in other planes. you are my guest of honor. Okay, so what's gonna happen what next? What will happen next? Depends on you, Susan. Right. Inside my house, there are dark hallways that lead to places you don't want to see. Right. But there is also something that will make you want to return to where you came from and cherish every single little breath you take. I'm going to make you an offer, Susan. It's a chance only a fool would refuse. Well, she doesn't seem too okay. bright to me. An offer? What can you offer me? Well, she's offering Let's you life for inside. a start, you dozy mare. It's getting cold out here. Yay, we're inside the creepy woman's house. Painting. Oh, look at. The lonely seashore. Yeah, touch it. Touch Please it. Please don't touch anything, dear. I wasn't going to. You lied, you lied to the whole world, Susan. And you lied to yourself. Yep. Okay. Yep. Look at her. She really here. Maybe this is a dream after all. Maybe this is this is all the pills you've taken. Now we can talk properly, my dear. Yes, without the the weird echoey voice. I don't know still who don't really know who you are. I go by many names. I've never paid much notice to what the living call me. But there is one name the fallen ones use when I speak to them. I find it most accurate. And that is? The Queen of Maggots. Okay. Is that what you are? Why maggots? Because they feed on what's dead and gone. Dead and gone. I guess that's me. Yep, no shit, Sherlock. Will I be punished for taking my own life? Will I be punished for taking my own life? Could you, right, be dear busy, voice actor, but not you, work harder. Susan. You see, I watched you long enough to understand how you feel. I don't expect you to believe me, but I actually have sympathy for you. Who knows, I could be your only friend. Okay, creepy lady, the never only trust friend creepy ladies. in the whole wide world. So like I said, I'm going to make you an offer. I want to help you. I will give you back your happiness in exchange for a simple task. Your life will change completely. You will be yourself again. And you will soon forget mm. the sadness that has consumed your heart for years. Okay, what do you want from me? What do you want me to do? Yes, I think it's time to explain. Yeah, I think it might just be. But where are my manners? They're still in the hall. This is not a place for a serious talk. Follow me to the next room. I'll tell you everything you need to know. Right. Okay. To piano. Be What's your piano, offer piano, then? Piano, what can piano, you fix piano. that life has destroyed? Susan, death can fix nothing. 
But though we are both dead, I am not death. Uh -huh. I might seem just like a strange old woman to you, but I'm just as powerful as gods. Uh -huh. And I chose you, Susan Ashworth. I need okay. you to go back and face five people. They're not ordinary people. They're very special. Just like you. Mm -hmm. Only in a slightly different way. Right. Okay. I'm a failure! Oh, Why did you choose me? Aren't you afraid I will let you down? Whatever it is I have to do. What was that? Most days, noise? it's enough of a struggle to crawl out of bed. Creepy noises. I don't see the point in anything. I just want to disappear. And I hate everyone else because they know how to be happy. Everywhere I turn, there are people filled with hope and will to live. Well, what is that? So pitiful. What is they that make me face to the to color? Alive. Oh, is she looking I at me? Is she breaking the fourth wall there? there for me. I am alone. I just want to vanish. Slap her! This is the very reason I chose you, Susan Ashworth. Okay. I know how you feel. Because I felt like this myself for a very long time. Did you now? You and me are very much alive. Are we if now? If you succeed, you will never feel broken again. The five people, who Those are they? five people, who are they? The parasites. That's what I call them. Parasites? Hmm. They don't know each other, but their destinies are bound together. You will have to keep your eyes open and be constantly on guard. Those right. people will want to get closer to you. They might even pretend they are your friends, but don't let that fool you. Right, okay. They have nothing but cruel intentions. They'll want to hurt you, Susan. Okay. They'll want to kill you. Well, I wanted to do that myself, so it won't as have an issue. As as they might appear, parasites are the evil scum of the earth. Okay. And they all deserve to die. Naturally. Is it bad enough without them? Don't be frightened. You will have a great advantage over them. They don't mm -hmm. know that you know. Do you understand what it means? You will become my hunter. Okay. Serving punishment for their sins. A tool of destruction. A dark angel. Yay! Through the river of blood. Yay, you blood! You in Woo! life and you see for the first time how satisfying it can be. But how will I recognize them? So isn't a great deal of people in your lonely life, is there, Susan? No. You will know when you see them. Bring those deceitful bastards in front of me, and we'll make them regret for everything they've done. You expecting me to kill them? Are you expecting me to kill them? No, Susan, I'm expecting you to fight for survival. To do everything you can to defend yourself. This got a hell of a lot more interesting. I know you're not a murderer. Quite the opposite, actually. You're a good person. But I also know that you don't want to suffer. And those uh -huh. people will want to cause you pain. They won't hesitate. This game got a hell of a lot In more interesting end, quickly. <laughs> you might have no choice. Think of it as gardening. If there were weeds among the flowers, you'd pull them out, wouldn't you? Probably. You'd get rid of them without thinking twice about it. I'm not really a gardening type, but I see your point. I'm glad. And remember this, you are not the only victim. If you don't stop them, the killing will continue. Innocent people will die. You have the opportunity nice. to make the difference. <gasps> oh, badger, badger, bar. Yes, it's you, Susan. Come closer. 
Maybe so I'm not. Jesus. I don't want to look at it. Haven't I had enough yet? That body in the ambulance. Then the forest. But this place is... This is exactly what I was trying to run away from. I don't want to be here. Make it go away. I assumed it would be wise to give you a little taste of the suffering you'd endure. I want you to understand that you can keep going long after you count. Okay. Take the crowbar. Yeah. Let's see what we've gone. Crucified all alone in one place. That's changed it all. Really don't want to be here. <coughs> okay. A little flashing of the screen. And silence. Death. Talk to. Susan. It's time to make a decision. Oh! Fuck me. The parasites are coming, whether you want it or not. Okay. You haven't really got much choice. Okay. Stop you being must creepy. Stand up for yourself. Fine, I'll do what you want. I'll do what you want. Excellent. I'm glad you have put your trust in me. It's not really trust, it's more sort of, oh my god, what the I fuck? Lights up. What? What? Yeah, baby. Back in the house. Okay. Can I move? We're back in the house. Oh, right. Yes. That was a that was a thing. But there is something else <clears throat> that must be done. You cannot leave my kingdom before a sacrifice is made. What? Isn't it enough already? Do not worry, my child. This is a mere formality I'm speaking of. The door to your world won't open unless you make a sacrifice of soul and a sacrifice of blood. What? It doesn't sound good at all. No, it really See those doesn't. candles here? Mm -hmm. Just blow one out and that's it. Like I said, <coughs> it's just a formality. Then on your way out, you will have to shed a few drops of blood. Not much, just a bit. Enough to open the door. How much, exactly? Don't be afraid. You can't die. It's easy. Anyone can do it. <coughs> just a sharp scratch. Is that how you used to say it? Okay, tell me about the sacrifice Tell me of about soul. the sacrifice of soul. Like Come on. I said, it's just a formality. See those candles here? All right, just okay. Just blow one out, and that's it. But which one? You can choose. It doesn't matter as long as you do it. Okay, fine. Fine. I'll do that. Wish me luck, strange lady. I do. When you leave my house, head to the field. Okay. That's where you should be. Goodbye, my child. Okay, latest dude. I'm not going to be far. That's what worries me. I've never been. Which candle should we pick? I'm going to pick uh, this one. What was that? Oh, shit. What have I done? Oh my god, what have I done? They left me no choice, Alice. Maybe <clears throat> one day you'll forgive me. God, did I do that? <clears throat> what the ever-living fuck? Come on, let's crowbar off those boards. Use. 
It's looking in the hole. It says emergency power switch danger. Okay, it's dark inside. There's all this blood around. Was someone hurt it? Reach inside. Okay. What the fuck? Okay, not a, a lot of blood, but enough, apparently. Okay. What the? You just of uh, uh, her? Apparently, my arm has come off. Okay, this was apparently the introduction. Fuck me. Fuck. Run through the intro credits. Run. Bang. Wasn't much blood at all. Welcome to the cat lady. Now that I think about it, there's something else too. Like I'll what? I'll tell you this, Susan. He starts talking to you and you just open up and tell him everything. It's very odd. I don't exactly hide things from people, but he got some really private stuff out of me. Really private. You know what I mean? Things I wouldn't tell my mother about. And we haven't even started those sessions yet. So, be prepared for that. Sure. But it's a bit too late for me to hide how I feel now anyway. I think I made it very clear when I swallowed those pills. Okay. I'm tired. Let I'm me sleep. I'm tired. Let me sleep now. Fine. I'll see you again. Be careful who you trust here, Susan. They will be watching you. How do I know you're not one of them? You don't. Which probably means but you aren't. you not really look like a bad person to you. I... I don't know. Maybe not. I'll see you tonight. Remember what I said. Dreams are just dreams. But when they turn into nightmares, it's good to have someone there to pinch your arm and wake you up. Right? Hello, Doctor. We'll start with a little chat about your childhood. I want you to be as honest as possible. It's important if we want to get to the bottom uh -huh, of Uh-huh, creepy problem. Doctor dude. Count to ten and tell me when you're ready, Susan. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Go on, then. Fine. This isn't all about whether you're nuts or not, like we said before. Uh -huh. It's about finding what has caused how you're feeling now and creating a working solution. Mm -hmm. In order to achieve that, I need to get to know you better. Do you Can now? talk about your childhood first? Fine, your I don't parents. care. When you're a child, your life revolves around them. Mm -hmm. What was your father like? Did you have a good relationship with him? Yeah, I had a great dad. Yeah, I had a great dad. I have very fond memories of my father. He was always there for me, no matter what I did. He never got angry or upset. I suppose I never really gave him any reasons to be. I was a good child. Not perfect. But... Then again, no one's perfect. Whatever made me uh -huh. try to kill myself, it definitely has nothing to do with him. Where is he now? He died six years ago. Cancer. 
Do you miss him? Of course I miss him. You cretin. How can you even ask me that? It's my job to ask these questions, Susan. Let's talk about your mother now. What was she like? Hmm. Would you care to tell me about her? Not really. I lost her when I was still a child. I lost her go. when I was still a child. So you were brought up by a single dad. What happened to your mother? She... Died giving birth. Died giving birth. I never even had a chance to meet her. I often wonder what she was like. Why is life so unfair? It's our one goddamn right to have a mother. No, it's not. But I was robbed of it. Right, so not, like that's not what right else. to like. Okay, I'm beginning to get a better picture. That's enough about your parents for now. Let's take two minutes and we will talk about something else. Okay. What's I need going? to get out of this place. I hate hospitals. Besides, I really want to go home and forget all about this. Yeah, you know, I don't blame you. Okay, I think I'm going to call it there because that seems like really long that I've been going on for. The story is intriguing. I'm not sure about the mechanics, but the story itself looks to be really good. And it looks like you can change different things about it. So, anyway, I have been Zombie Cleo. This has been the Cat Lady, class dismissed. <laughs>